Hey folks, it's Frithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Prison Architect. Just to make that look good as well. Okay. Everything is in there, everything is done. I just need to join these fences in in a minute. I'm not quite ready to do that yet. I've got those going around the outside. There was a death. There he is. I'm not quite sure. Oh, overdosed. Oh, that's not good. We do need to do some stuff about that, like the, the different um, things that could be going wrong with various prisoners. Walls and doors again. Go to fence. So now I can finally fill in the last bits of these fences. And that one in there. Go like that. And then take demolish walls. Fill the capacity. I've got four new prisoners arriving soon. All the way up through there like that. Remove them. And then they'll be able to get out. So they are currently getting through. And then that bit's going to be open. This side, this part of the prison is going to be open as well. And I've now got that bit open. Right. I've just got the lights going up through there. I'm, I'm going to ignore the lights for a minute. So what I really want is another cell block. That's what I'd like. And I'm kind of thinking, because I've been told, keeping the power station, keeping them separate. When I build new power stations, keep them separate and away from previous power station places. This right here, I've got a staff door on there. I've got a normal door on there. This is all brickwork that I want in here. So I'm going to change this over a minute. We're going to go for a brick wall there. Down here. Back round over to there. And down to there like that. Right. I will have a look in reports. No, we won't. We want to go to grants available. Maxec infrastructure. Increase the size of security. Unlock body armor. Unlock tasers. Build CCTV. Place CCTV throughout the prison. Oh, there's one thing that I do want to do. And that is tax relief. We will start that one. Legal prep. Fairly big legal. Uh, your lawyer will start paperwork to help keep the heat off should something go wrong. But this needs to be done in advance. Now that's 50 grand, that is. So I'm going to leave that bit. Taser rollout. Taser, your regular guards may also carry tasers for defense. They must visit the armory to get this equipment. And it will cost you for every taser purchased this way. We will get that one, and we will also go for orderlies, because those are both fairly cheap ones to do. I've got the changeover going on there. Then I wanted to go into... So we've got the criminally insane cell block C to raise prisoner capacity, which we'll do soon. Tool cleanup, which we will do soon. Crack down on drugs, find 10 illegal narcotics. Crack down on drugs and tool cleanup seems to be one that I want to do both at the same time. Then, climatization and engagement. Laundry, kitchen, cleaning cupboard. I haven't built a laundry yet. Reform. Bureaucracy, classroom, 20 school desks, 10 prisoners, foundation, and one general education. That's another one that we're going to do. So, this room in here, I want to do parole. Rooms. Parole. I'm going to turn that into a parole room. Right, how big? Minimum of 5x5. Five five. I don't need it to be any bigger than a 5x5, five five, do I? So I got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 down. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So I'll put the wall down here. I'm going to change that again. I'm going to put a new wall in. Right. 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So I'm going to put a wall down there. And I'm going to get rid of... That wall. So that will become a parole office. Now with parole, I think I just want a regular door on it. Which I can't do like that. So I've got to get rid of the door. And then go here. Dismantle. Right. Take that one apart. They're building this bit. Narcotics on you. Yeah, that's fine. Um, ooh, I got concrete wall left on there. I shouldn't have. Oh, no, there is an order for replacing that one. That's fine. Um, they will finish building that wall there, and then this is going to be parole. 
Turn that to the parole office. We want to put a door on that, which is going to be a regular door. I'll drop that one onto there. I need a visitor table. So I want to go floor blah, blah, objects over here. That's the one that I want, a visitor table. So that one will go there. And that is pretty much all I'm going to need to do. I'm not going to put that one in yet. Because what I'm going to do, I'm going to take that light and I'm going to move it to there. That light, I'm going to put it to there. Objects, light, one there and one there. Then I will get the visitor table. And I'll put that one there like that. So I've now got a parole office so they're able to start doing paroles. Rooms over here. I'm going to do more walls and doors. I'm going to take a regular door. I'm going to bring that one over to there like that. I'm going to do exactly the same again. I'm going to go one, two, three, four, five, and put a wall down there. I've already got a door on that side. Then I will go... That light can move to there. That one can go to there. That one can go to there. Is he moving that light at the moment, or is he building something? He's dismantling the light. Right, well, as he's dismantled the light, I've got one spare, so I will drop that one into there, and that's where it's going to go. So there's the rest of those bits. Then I can go to objects again, and I can put a second visitor table in there. And I can turn that into another parole room. Where is... Uh, there's parole over there. And... Job done. Did I... I think I put in the visitor table. Yes, I have. Right. The visitor table has been ordered. So I got two paro... Wait. One, two... One, two, three, four... Yep, yeah, that is right. Yeah. Okay. I've done, I've done that correct. So I got two parole rooms in there... So I'm going to go here, Regime. We've got the eat time. I've got shower time over here. So they've all got shower time. Needs, luxuries, literature, jobs, intake, field of capacity, programs. And now I need to start parole programs. Foundation education. I got people interested. We'll have to. We will build a classroom that's on the to-do list. So is ki well. I could actually do kitchen safety and hygiene, but it's parole hearing. I want to do. Start. Go up here. There. No room found. It's because that was not ready yet. As soon as he's gone and put that bit up, this room here will be ready. Well, they, they do have to bring over that one. So there's... What's the... Re oh, that's where I am now. So there's 6 p.m. till 10 p.m. So I got four of those. Three and four like that. And he's going to put that one in. So I've got four parole hearings in each room. I think I'm going to have to stop those and then start them again. One, two, three, four. There. There. That's more like it. Plenty of parole hearings over there. That's going to keep those rolling through. I've, I like this idea. I think this is good. And then I'm going to go back over to walls and doors. No, I'm not. I'm going to go to flooring again. I'm going to get the old grass going again. And we're going to come down here like this. And we're going to put... A little bit of grass out over that side like that. Give our workers a little bit of something to do. Keep them busy just for a second. The rest of this is actually all right. It's neat and tidy and clean all the way around. The janitors are going to take a minute or two to be able to actually get around everything. I uh, the deployment. I've got staff only. Insane, access, medium sec only, visitors directions, assign, right, I've got guards assigned in there, staff only out here, the staff only all the way out here for this whole area, and then in here, this that's the yard there, so that's a big shared area out there, and then 
canteen is shared. So is the morgue, the common room, the shower room. That is. Just make sure that those are. The kennel room shouldn't be. That should be protected, supermax. Guards, oh, staff only. Staff only in there. Staff only in that one as well. Is there anything else that I want to limit? To Well, it's definitely staff only in the armory. Definitely don't, I don't want prisoners going into the armory. That's, that's, that is for definite, sure. And I think that's pretty good so far. Now, I, I am wondering about doing a perimeter wall. Like a proper perimeter wall all the way around. I'm wondering if maybe that would be a good idea. But tool cleanup, remove the supply of stolen tools, remove the supply of stolen weapons, and also... Oh, I've already done the other one. That one's about to start. Needs grants. Yeah, I had the other one, which was... Uh, maintenance, health and well... No. The crackdown on drugs. Yeah, that one's done. The tool cleanup is in progress. Um, stolen tools and weapons. I'm not going to worry about it. I'm going to leave that. Now, reform through. That would be education. So, we're going to go with cell block C. Start to make things a bit bigger. Because I want to change things around a little bit. I've got those cells there. Before I start building the cells, though, we need to go to intake and close intake. For a minute, I'm not going to change intake because I want to change around what prisoners can go where. What are you doing out here? He needs to go. Found drugs. He needs to go to solitary. I don't know why he's out here anyway. Okay, so this is going to be the next cell block. This cell block here is going to end up ultimately being the... Low security cell block. So the one I'm going to build here is going to be medium security. And then I'm going to do one down here for high security. So the medium security cell block. That one is going to be... Wait a minute. Quick build. Improved cells. I've got basics, improved, and luxuries. Now, I don't want to do shared cells. I'm not really worried about that. Um... I'm curious if we should be using solitary cells for the supermax people, or if we just use the basic cells for them. But anyway, it's, it's this one right here, which is three across. The in, the inner structure of it is uh, three by five. No, three by three by four. The inside area of that is three by four. I mean, it's going to take a little bit of planning to be able to get that one exactly right, isn't it? If, Okay, I can just drop that down. Something was bleating at me just then, wasn't it? I don't know. That's the basic idea there. I'll get rid of that a second. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to foundations. I'm going to go with brick foundation. Now, each of these buildings is going to be slightly different. I'm going to do different buildings for different things. More. Main. We did have the rusty wall. I don't know what's happened to my rusty wall one that I had. Uh, seriously, I don't know where that one's gone. I should have the rusty wall bit, didn't I? Sh shouldn't I? I've got the... But that was all part of the DLC and everything, wasn't it? And I, I do have that. I've got all of the new stuff. You go into the quick build. I've got the psychiatrist, the padded offices, the cells. Uh, I've got all of the padded things that we would need. So I don't really know why I don't have the, that other one. But anyway, basic one would be brick walls. I can go white. I can go with tiles, art decos, cushioned, classy blue, classy green, oriental style wall, Utani. See, this isn't the ones that I want. I don't want these types of classy ones. I want the like the, the rusty walls and, and stuff like that. So, classy, we'll end up changing that for classy because that's going to be like the, the really nice bit. And then, I suppose we could do brick wall here, oriental, classy green, classy blue stripes. 
white walls. Let's do white. We haven't done white. So I will do white walls over here. I'll make it... We go about that far over, I think. Let's go there to start with. We'll make it about that big just to start with. And I'm going to go walls and doors. And I'm going to put a door on there so that they've got one in place. Right. That's that bit done on there. That's, that's the first part of that cell. They're going to go through and they're going to start working on that. Once they've done that, once they've laid all of this out, I'll get the rest of it all done as well. He's... Why is he sat there? I don't... I, 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 I'm really curious why he's just sat there. Nobody seems to be doing anything with him. Someone needs to do something to him. At some point, I would assume... Oh, uh, well, never mind. Right. Um, so I've got my solitary block over here. This one, once this cell block is finished... I'm then going to strip this one out, and I'm going to change it over to luxury cells all the way around, which means I'm going to need to kind of, like, disconnect a whole load of stuff. Uh, I've got that one there. I could do a building. Another, if I build another power station, then that one can power everything over on this side. So I've got that power station for everything in here. Water. I don't know if you need more than one water, um, one pump station. I don't think you do. That one will move over to there. That one can move over to there. Uh, objects, lights, one in each corner. And then I want to go to utilities. Right, first of all, we want to put in electric cable this way. Like that, and then up there like that. Dismantle utility. Over to there. Dismantle that utility. I'm not going to re remove that until the rest of it has been all taken out. That one. Remove that bit. Remove that down to there. Well, I'm not actually going to need to remove that big water pipe. That can stay where it is. So I've, I've removed some of the utilities. It's going to be all right leaving that bit in because this is where I want to build the new one. So that can stay as it is. There is our new area in here. I've got the... Ah, right. He's been... He's now being taken away. That's good. And uh, walls and doors, we're going to go white wall. And that is going to go all the way over to there. And it's going to go all the way down to there. So I've now got the outside edge of this one. Then, I want to go into quick build, and I want to go to an improved cell. This one has a TV and a toilet in it, and a shower as well. So that'll go over to there. I've got a gap of two, and so the toilet's at the top, and a gap of two, and then I've got the shower. Right. Concrete, no, I don't want concrete wall. I need to brick wall, barred, white... Tiled, wall cushioned, classy, oriental, green, blue stripes, utani, and then back to concrete. Cushioned. Did it, it said barred wall there, didn't it? Art deco, tiled, white, a barred wall. What's that look like? Oh, it's like that all the way around. Ah. No, I don't want to do that. That's not one that I would like. So I'll go quick build. Let's get the one improved cell built. So I want that. That's got to be white walls. You can go into there. We get one of those being built. And then I can start planning out how I'm going to do the rest of this prison. Uh, the, the rest of these this cell block. Get all of that sort of worked through. So we will rush that one along a bit faster. Now, I'm not doing anything specific to go hunting out the supply of stolen tools and weapons and stuff like that. It's not something I'm chasing after. Slow down again and go back into utilities and we will drop down into here. I want to get a power station in there. 
And this is exactly the right size for a power station, which is perfect. I'm going to put those into there, and that one over to there, and that one into there. So there is that bit done. And come out of there. I've got one of those doors. So that door there. Click on that one and dismantle, and then go to walls and doors. I can't put that one in. I've got to wait for them to remove the door before I can order the next one being put in. What I can do is I can... No, I don't want to even do that because I've got to wait for them to replace the door. So I can't, I can't, I can't like, change anything over and um, put a different... Um, who's me call it? Thingamajiggy on. i leave that as it is. So let's whiz it along like this and let them put a few things in there. There we go. That one's gone in and they're putting in all of the new stuff. Walls and doors put a staff door on that one in there. Definitely don't want to change that one over. Now, why have I got that one there? He's carrying staff key. What's the guard doing? Um, he's gone and picked something up, I think. Not quite sure what happened there. But he's, he's picked something up with it. That's installed and that's installed. So I've now got another one of them up and running. That cell block is also up and running and done. I'm going to leave the cell block for a minute and we're going to go in this way. We want to start building up the next lot of utilities. So dismantle the utility. I'm going to take that one out there. It's not a good idea to have loops for utilities, is it? So I'm going to remove those. That one can stay where it is, then the rest will be removed. And then I want to go to deployment in here. Staff only in that room. That's done. Get rid of that. That's, yeah, that's looking good. We've got staff only in that one. I've got the parole board here. He's busy. Oh, he's, he's, clear, he's clearing stuff out from underneath. That's all right as well. And we've got those to be removed. And then back to utilities over here. If I take a large pipe, I'm going to run that one over to there. And this is going to run down the outside edge of the prison. I don't quite know where it's going to go yet. I've got to finish installing those cells all the way along there. I've got the next power grid there. And this one is one that's going to run out along here as well. We'll only go that far at the moment. So that's going to be over in this part of the prison. Don't want to do any more than that. And then I want to go over here. So that's saying that's a cell in there. I haven't got anybody to go in it. So it's, it's all right at the moment. I don't have anybody that I want to go and put in it. And I don't want to be putting anybody in it either. So let's go to a an A, an a improved and improved cell. I don't quite know why I've got people coming to stay in here. It shouldn't be. Not yet. Right, we will go there and there and there and then how am I gonna do this? This is this is what I'm wondering about now. I'm gonna turn that one round. It's gonna have a gap of two underneath, and you're gonna go through here like this. So I can put them in there. And then I'm gonna want Well, first up, we're gonna need to Clear a little bit of the... So we go to walls and doors. Demolish the walls. And I'm going to want to remove that one and that one. And then I'm going to want to go with that door there. And I'm going to want to dismantle that door. So they'll remove that as well. That Get that out of the way. Then we're going to go with the quick build again. We go back to our improved cells. And... Down through the middle. Do I have a gap of two or do I put a gap of three down through there? Big question, I guess. That's running right down through the middle and I have four on each side. I put one there. Because that's, kind of, that's going to kind of be a dead end up there. But it doesn't really matter. And I put one there and then that's going to fit perfectly. I can actually put another one in there. 
So that cell will go in there, and then this side will leave gaps. And then that one will go into here, like that. And it's whether or not I go out by one more. I would, the reason that I wasn't going to go out by one more was because I wanted to use some of this space to produce some more rooms for them. So that yard there for... Although this yard could be a separate yard. I could build a... Yeah, I'll leave it like this, I think. I genuinely don't know at the moment, because, look, what I'm thinking is, if that goes out a little bit wider, I was wondering about putting an additional canteen down here, or extending the canteen out. If I narrow this gap here too much, if I put another line of cells here, I'm going to have to bring that one r whole room out to about over here somewhere. Uh, that's, that's eating into the space that we've got. And then the canteen can't be extended very far. I'm going to want that one a bit bigger. And I'm thinking that medium security and low security, which will be here, they will be able to access that canteen. Maximum security. But then I've got maximum security people here. Right? He is a maximum security prisoner. And I've got mixed security at the moment and they all seem to be able to go in together so maybe we could put all three of them together into one canteen i was wondering about keeping max security separate from the rest but no we don't need to do that and maybe i could just leave these prison cells as they are and keep those for the maximum security build medium security in here and do the low security out this side and then put in a few extra buildings so that one there can just sort of be extended downwards and then down here somewhere, is where I will build the Supermax. And that Supermax is going to be in a separate facility altogether, I think. That's that's one thing I would like to do, is, is put them in a completely separate zone. I like the idea of just moving that out by one more, because it, it, it'll be more balanced. That's the main reason, is it will be more balanced. So I want to go out by four spaces out this side. So I'm going to go to more, and I'm going to white wall. One, two, three... Four out there. And run that down. So that's the top edge there, all done. And then I want to go walls and doors, and I want to get a large jail door on here now. Low security, orange is medium security. That's what this one is. So I want a large medium security jail door on here. It's actually going to go out there, like that. That one's going to go there. And then, I don't need to demolish that wall. That wall is actually right where it needs to be. And then we can go with utilities, staff, objects. No, uh, quick build. Go back to that one again. Go to the improved cell. Swivel that round and drop one, two, three of those into there. I'll just wait for them to finish building that bit. And then I can put that one in. I'm going to want objects in here, and I'm going to want lights. We're going to put one light on that bit in the middle of each cell. Like that. Which I think is going to work quite nicely. There, there, and there as well. And then lights inside the building. I will do outside of this cell like this. All the way down through. That's going to look pretty good. And then here in the middle, I'm going to do my usual every other one. And this, I'm going to do a straight line all the way down with every other one. Down to there, at least. Right. We're making progress. We're making definite progress. Let's, let's rush this along a little bit. Our workforce is getting a little bit tired, so we're going to let them rest up for a minute. If you've enjoyed the episode, then please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to go and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye, and see you later.